Come on, Ayo. Come on. Amazon packages? Why do I suck at that line, dude? <laughs> in today's video, we're gonna be surviving 24 hours with only these two fishing rods and all the items inside of this Amazon mystery pallet. If you guys don't know what an Amazon mystery pallet is, basically they return packages from Amazon. Anybody could. They all get put into a truck and then you can buy pallets for money. How much money? We have a $900 pallet behind us, but what they say, there should be $2,000 worth of items in here, but you don't know what you're gonna get. But return, so broken, not usable, or lost. Or, or they just didn't want it. Any reason you would ever have to return a package it is gonna be in this. The list is simple. Three objectives. Build a fire, build a shelter, catch a fish. Let's start. So guys, I picked this up from a warehouse. We bought two of them for 450. They're called medium pallets. And medium pallets are medium price, but also have medium sized packages. So a small oh. pallet has 1,500 items, it's $1,000. Basically there's different size pallets. We have two medium pallets going on here. I thought it was a paddle. What is that, just a system of poles? <laughs> oh God. What do we have here, my friend? Body Blade Pro. Oh, dude, we're gonna be in shape. What do you mean? <laughs> yep. <laughs> it kind of burns. Oh, and then, golly, gets the glutes and the chest. I kind of want to see what's in this like massive. Oh, yeah. dude, I know. okay. Come on, baby. This is what we could sleep on tonight. Look at this, a big old mattress pad. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, there's air on. Oh no. Oh great. Can't use a mattress pad <laughs> and return it. I wonder if they just did the trial out of bed for three months. That means something terrible happened on this bed. What is this stain? Oh yeah, see that? It kind of looks like urine. <laughs> Somebody peed on it, so they returned it. Dude, there's so many stains everywhere. Let's roll this thing out and see if there's like a blood stain. It is really nice. <laughs> it is so comfortable, dude. I would have kept this. I feel like this was a three-year-old's bed and he peed in it. <laughs> they had to give it back. Wish. It's gotta be urine. What is this? <laughs> it has to be. That's looking like pee, but I'll sleep in some pee, bro. I'd rather sleep in pee than sleep in sand. Put that on, T-shirt. Yep. I'm actually very excited to see what this <laughs> is. On the side of the box, we have description, Egyptian costume, three-piece set, spiky headband, cuffs, cobra cream cuffs. <laughs> Is that like handcuffs? Or is that like... What the world? <laughs> this isn't one costume, this is 45 costumes. <laughs> what the heck? Dude, somebody bought a lot of Egyptian costumes and decided that that was the theme of their birthday party. So the headband is literally just one head, like a hairband, and then they took black zip ties and spray painted them gold. Dude, there's no way we're making our money back. <laughs> so guys, the thing with this is it could be a viable business plan. Like people buy Amazon return pallets and they sell everything online and get more money than what they paid for them. But so far we've got a used mattress and an Egyptian costume set. Dang girl. Oh dang dude, sucks to suck. So we have 50 Egyptian little staff, cobra staffs? Cobra staffs. We could use these to pitch a tent. Oh. You see what I'm saying? So even if we get a ton of junk, we gotta figure out a way to make shelter out of all the junk, which is kind of like a fun thing. And I'd also love to make some money off this stuff, honestly, make it back. But so far we've opened up <laughs> 50 costumes made out of plastic. Get a rug? Rug, baby. <laughs> it's like the first box you open is a rush and then the next box is not as big a rush but yeah. you keep opening boxes hoping to have the same rush as you had before never happens but you keep getting new boxes oh dude look oh. at this oh, oh we got a movie. comforter to match our peed on bed frame dude. <laughs> let's go this actually looks like new this looks like somebody bought it and never tried it to avoid danger of suffocation keep this plastic bag away from babies <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, I'm actually happy about this, dude. We're gonna be warm tonight, so thank goodness for Florida, it's 85 degrees. Yeah. We could definitely use a blanket. Yeah. You know what I'm hoping for, dude, is somehow we get a tent, or like something to start a fire would be amazing, because so be. far we have like... I think we have at least a place to sleep right now. I think so too, with the rugs and everything too. Dude, we could make a NFT about these rugs and like you can put them together and they make yeah. different rugs. Like little eggs and they hatch other rugs. <laughs> then we can do like a big rug pull and like make millions of dollars. Rug pull. Rug pumping pull. pumping Let's rug. Let's go, dude. Logan Paul, if you want to collab, hit us off, dude. Yeah, dude. I, I think you're innocent, dude. I don't, but I still like your stuff, dude. Don't yeah. put that out. It's. Dude, it's just money, bro. Think yeah. about it. Las Vegas Raiders, dude. Kind of like Logan Paul rating your bank accounts, baby. <laughs> dude, this one has broken glass. Handle with care, fragile, thank you. Oh, yes, dude, just broken glass bulbs. Oh, dude, I can see myself in this. Look. Oh, it's like a selfie ball, so you can like... Whoa. Yeah, you can like see yourself in it. Whoa, my eyes are playing games. Do you see it? We got baby one reindeer. We got this. hypoallergenic infant formula <laughs> with iron. Oh, we have food. Oh, dude. Well, we at least found warmth for the night. It came with a mom and, yeah. a, and a baby one, and so we figured I'd be the mom and he'd be the baby. Let's keep on boxing. <laughs> Dude, is this a pillow? Oh, that is so clutch. We got a pillow, man. We have like a full-on bed set. Uh-oh. Mackerel and olive oil. Baby formula. Tomato soup, dude. <laughs> I hate tomato soup. Any form of tomato in a drink or beverage or soup. Ugh. I just don't trust people that drink that stuff, dude. Boy, we're gonna eat later tonight, so. Oh, that's perfect, though. That's the first survival thing we've got. 10 hours protection, too. Damn. Oh, what do we have here? That looks good. That, that could be orpies. something. Oh, wait, hold on. It's like a weird material, like it's a leather. Dude, if we get the bed and we like build this up. A-frame, dude. Yes, we got a tarp. That is actually, that actually makes dude, me so happy. This is gonna go so fast now. Hey, Norm, you put your money like right here, dog. Hey, if you guys wanna invest in my company. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a cup holder for a car. What, is this like a brush guard? Dude, that could easily fit like a electric golf cart or something. Yeah. Like a chastity belt for your car, dog. We spent $900 on, I guess, survival items. We were better off with the $5 from the dollar store. We really were. So out of $2,000 in Amazon items, we have a tarp, we have a selection of food varying from mackerel, which I've never tried before. And that's mm. probably gonna be discussing protein bars that are expired, baby formula, tomato soup. We do have bug spray, probably the clutchest thing we found in the box. And then we have peed mattress. Peed mattress. Peed on mattress. A brand new pillow and a brand new blanket. So, we gotta build for it. Go fishing tonight, see if we can catch some food. We're gonna have to eat all this stuff that's here, but I'm just not looking forward to it. Oh gosh. Let's build shelter. Let's do it. Oh. Road pool. All right, so, here's the plan. We have our very limited item selection. We have some disgusting food. So we're gonna build shelter first, then try to go fish and catch food. Okay. And if we can't do that, I mean, we're, we are gonna eat the sardines and the tomato soup. It's gonna be, oh, I hate tomato soup. Disgusting, but we gotta kind of set up shelter while we still got a little bit of daylight left because there is night lights out here with like snook and tarpon. So that could go kind of crazy. We I've might be able to either. catch. I haven't either. And tons of other species, so it could be pretty cool. Okay, okay. You were talking about an A-frame. How do you build an A-frame shelter? It is one of the simplest survival shelters to build. You ready for this build sequence? I'm ready. Oh, stop, Mom. All right, we need one long stick. Just need one. You see anything over there? You got one? Yeah. Hey, I got a stick. I like the stick, man. We this need to break the other sticks off. Oh! Dude, that literally, it was so 
fresh, the tree just bent all the way over when it snapped swung like 80 miles an hour right into my cankle, dude. All right, build sequence, start. Ready, brother? Honestly, I think that's perfect. Yeah, let's take her down. Looks kind of cool, man. One time I ate a really burned hamburger <laughs> and laid one of these things. <laughs> Try to have an even amount of tarp on each side. <laughs> We want this thing to be as long as it can be because we don't want the no seams and mosquitoes just to eat us up all night. That would be brutal. We do have bug spray, but in my opinion, there's no amount of bug spray you could put on to keep those little dirty dogs off of you all night. Guys, the sun is going down, but I'm gonna look for some rocks to sit on our A-frame here. That way we can at least be covered. I don't think it's gonna rain tonight, but I have no clue. But just so we have a little bit of shelter to cover us. There's a lot of noceums out here, which are like little tiny bugs that bite you. I haven't seen any rocks on the island. I think I might have to run out in the water. I think these will do. I could add a stick in the middle of each side. It has to fit me and Norm. Found any rocks, bro? Dude. Found the rocks, man. Yes. Some big ones. I could hammer these. Oh, yeah. I see. I got you, man. The cool thing is, is they're really sharp rocks, so every time you hit it, it just stabs you. Dude, it's kind of pretty good already. Yeah, I think I think it's really good. I think if we can fit the mat and the comforter under there. Oh, you added like an extra like little uh, branch under there too. Dude, that's yeah. perfect. Isn't it? That's a yeah. Quick... Then we're gonna have the mattress, or the mattress pad and then the yep. mattress cover. Dude, we're gonna be sleeping good, man. And we have bug spray. And we have each other. And a pillow. And a pillow. And each other. And each other. Ah, perfect. Let's get in there. Hmm. Oh, come on! <laughs> There's room for two. This is awesome. Isn't it? This is a really cool fort, and this only took us like literally five minutes to set up. That's what I'm saying. Speed build a shelter. If you got to, tarp. Yeah, dude, A-frame tarp method is, it literally only takes two sticks, one long one, and a tarp. If we had one bigger stick, this thing would be massive. Yeah. <laughs> but honestly, just to sleep, not bad. I'm actually really comfortable. The mattress pad and the mattress, and then you having the pillow is pretty comfy. <laughs> nah, this is awesome, dude. We're protected from the elements. Yep. Dude, good job, dude. A-frame. Dat that up. Dude, we made a shelter out of Amazon pallets. All right, let's go eat. All right. <laughs> I'm willing to make a $10 bet with you right now. <laughs> Whoever chugs this fastest, 10 bucks. Deal. Are you gonna chug this whole thing? If you do. I don't think I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Welcome back to Norm Neo's Camping Food Review. Today on the menu we have baby formula. I haven't had that since I was a baby. We have tomato juice. I haven't had that since I was sick, but I never get sick because I have a strong immune system and great genetics. Dude, no way. This has fast relief from severe crying. Dude, dude, somebody's should. going hard on the water. <laughs> I'm trying to survive here, dude. <laughs> I'm trying to survive. Stop hanging on your $200,000 boat. <laughs> and live it, dude. Uh. Some people don't have it like that. Last but not least, King Oscar Royal Fillets Mackerel and Olive Oil. It contains 3,500 milligrams of omega-3 fatty acids per serving. I can't hear it! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Ah, ah, ah. Mom! <laughs> Stop! I dude, tried. Like, uh, everywhere we go, dude, like we just, we're out on an island, thought we'd get away from copyright music. <laughs> no, it follows us, man. Yeah, dude. It's like taxes. All right, guys, well, we're gonna try some hypoallergenic infant formula with some awesome background music. It's totally copyrighted, so. Um, God, this must be a remix. You feel that? Baby formula, it comes sealed to make sure that you don't get 
Sick? Mm, yeah, we crashed on the island, but we got baby formula. Just we like we got the formula for YouTube. Mm. Ooh, ooh, we got the quadratic equation because we found the hypotenuse. Dang, dude, that, that went down harder than our plane did. All right, you first. Oh, dude, give it a sniff. Give it a sniff. I smell nothing. Oh, I smelled it. Oh, it it smells, smells like babies. Oh, Does dude, it smell I, like babies? I really don't want to drink this, dude. June 2022. We're good. Oh. <laughs> oh, six months expired. You want to try first? No, you got it, man. Okay. Don't swallow, bro. Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. What? Did you hit my ankle? That is, that is hands down. <laughs> that's not even fun. That was a deep laugh. No, dude, like, that is genuinely disgusting. I don't know what. <laughs> Here we go. Just so you guys can see a visual. That is the worst thing you've ever put in your mouth. I guarantee it. God, dude, I can't. God, smelling that's brutal. It's a shame this is like one of the best things we got out of the package was expired baby formula. Golly. <laughs> what are you doing? Come on. Dude, I would rather die right no, there. We got another one, dude, and you're drinking it. No. No, I put it in my mouth. You got to put it in your mouth. That's, That's bro not code. how it works. That's no. bro code. No, it's not. It is bro code. That's called marriage. All right, next food item. <laughs> dude, you're not sliding with this, dude. No, you're you're drinking it. Come on. Dude, I really don't know. You're putting this in your mouth. Dude. You're putting it in your I'm mouth. Not, dude. No, no, you I'm are. So you are because you know why? Because nope. on your channel, I put things in my mouth I didn't want to put in my mouth, and now it's my turn to put something in your mouth that you don't want in it. Dude, tomato sauce, mackerel. It's like you just went to the dollar store and bought the nastiest stuff and put it in the package. It was like, oh my gosh. Did you really? I. God, I love this dude, channel. <laughs> dude, I thought that would have been a great idea. This is genuine, God. and that's what makes it so funny. Because I wouldn't have even been able to think of dude, something I like that. I can't even smell that, bro. I can't even smell that. Well, this one might not even be expired, dude. Let me see it. You're like freaking out. No, no, no. I just want to see it. No, don't look. You're going to ruin it for the viewers. Oh, dude, this one doesn't expire until 2024. You're good. All right, let me see it. Time's an illusion, bro. <laughs> Expiration, you don't expire unless you want to. You think you're ever gonna be out there on a boat playing tunes if you don't do a couple hard things in your life? Things is all easy in games. Drink some baby formula, dude. Stop being a baby. It's actually making me mad. It's crazy that I would do something and you wouldn't, bro. I'll even I'll shake it up for you, dude. You're being a big baby right now. Okay, one more sip. Go being a big baby. <laughs> yeah. Gosh, dude, it's so not. The smell oh. is the worst smell I've ever smelled. <laughs> I've smelled some smells, dude. Fred, big man. sip, big sip, dude. What? <laughs> you spit back in it, dude. I can't drink that. <laughs> you kidding me? No, dude, drink it. I'm so for real right now. <laughs> There's no way you're doing that right now. Oh, he's gonna crack. He's gonna crack. Dude, put, put, put a sip, put a gulp in. God, dude. I think I have a sis. God, Norm's such a sissy, dude. Oh, jeez. Dude. Dude, babies are tough. I can't believe you used to drink that stuff. All right, next food item. What's next? Oh, man. Oh, Norm, dude. All right. I feel like we have this terrible like taste in our mouth. I know some people think this is a delicacy, and for whatever reason, people buy mackerel and, mackerel and olive oil. Can't leave the circle <laughs> until you finish your, your dinner. Mm, dude, mm, mm, mm. I do not want to do this, but mackerel. <laughs> I will do it if I have to. <laughs> Team player, bro, that's what I am. You're tackling that. I'm tackling this. I don't want to have to do this either. Mackerel and olive oil. I'm allergic. Oh, that could be good fish bait, bro. That could be good fishing bait. You ready? Do you, you want to do a piece too? Yeah, I got you. Here you go. Dap it up. Let's go, bro. 
Oh, God. That's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad either. You gonna try one of these? It tastes like tuna fish. Dang. That's good. That's good. It's like tuna fish. Like I could eat that whole thing. I could too. Yeah, that's it's not bad. Salting crackers? That's really good. All right, so last Fantastic. thing. Tomato soup. I actually kind of like tomatoes, and tomatoes is good for man things. It is. It is. It's actually one of the best foods as a guy that you guys can eat. Really? Like it is. what type of things? It's good for your mouth stuff. I swear. It is. I don't know. It's that. really healthy. Yeah, it uh, prevents prostate cancer. No shot. Yep. What do you do? You just dip them in? Tomato soup. God, why'd you do it like that? I like tomato soup. Here you go. Uh, tomato soup is actually really good, man. It's not bad at all. <laughs> it's good. It's kind of a good dinner. God, when you eat it like that, though, it makes me feel weird. Food's done, dude. Fish were busting. I think we gotta go fishing, like, Eight awesome drive. pronto. Dude, we just ate and we built a shelter in like literally 15 minutes. Now we're gonna go fishing. The oh, island's really beautiful good. out here and there's fish all around it. So I just, the fish tingles are tingling. Gotta go get that line tight, dude. dude. Tight lines. When we planned out to wreck that airplane for the intro shot, we wrecked it perfect. <laughs> Okay, so it is now nighttime, and we are going fishing. We picked up Trey along the way. We found him, dude, off the plane, man. Floating out of box. Yeah. Dude, I jumped out. I was <laughs> I was under the cargo, and I just got sucked out whenever the plane went down. And I just, dude, I just somehow magically landed in the boat, and we were just. They can't pick us up. Wow. Yeah. Crazy. Now we're fishing. Crazy talk. In all reality, we just had to go fish some night lights. We just pulled up to the first one. There's fish swimming around it, so. We're gonna see what we can catch. We might cook something, but we are kind of full on baby formula, but we have to go fishing, obviously. <laughs> and it's not every day you're in South Florida and you get to go fishing at nighttime. So, nighttime, nighttime fishing nighttime in a boat. Fishing. And we got some shrimp, we got little jig heads, and 30 pound line, and some spinning combos. So, we're gonna, we're gonna have some fun. I hear them jumping. Oh, right they're jumping now. right in front. All right, let's go. What is it? I don't know. What's it, where's he throwing it? How have I not got that yet? You instantly did. You gotta get in the green line. Cast pass. Oh, I got one. I got one, dude. We're doubled. We're doubled. <laughs> dude, we got one. Let's go. No, he popped off. I got one, dude. Dang it, what'd you do? Oh my gosh, dude, that's a giant, dude. First cast. Let's go, Trey. <laughs> Holy smokes, dude. I don't even know if I've ever caught a jack before. Oh, there, man. Just, oh, oh, let's go, let's go, man, let's go. Go. Oh. You freaking <laughs> smoked me, dude. I cannot believe this happened this quick. I can. Oh my gosh, dude. What did you have? <sighs> let's go, dude. That's sick! Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, boy. Good start to the night, my friend. Hold yours further back towards you. Perfect. Ooh, you're pulling me down. <laughs> Sorry, dude. dude. Dude, let's go. Let's go. Dude. I told you it was going to happen. That's, that's, a, that's a nice size jack for a night in shore jack. First cast. Not bad, brother. Dialed up. They're talking to me. Let's get a pick and get them back. All right, brother. Oh. So guys, at night, a lot of times people will put green lights out on their docks. It attracts the fish or attracts the bait fish and the big fish come up. There is currently a school of a ton of decent sized fish and they're eating bait as we speak. So we're going to get close enough, but not too close to where we spook them. Make some casts and see what we can do. Okay, sure to show me. All right, ready? Yep. Oh, I'm over the dock, man. Oh, I got a fish on. <laughs> I thought I landed on the dock. I got one cast in there, Trey. You got, you got a bait? I got a bait. Oh, dude, literally first cast in there. I don't even know what it is. How's she pulling? Oh, it's, it's, it's not that big, but it's a fish. It's biting. Oh, it's a jack, dude. Let's go. <laughs> dude, that's my first ever jack. I've never really? caught one. Dude, I don't go saltwater fishing like that. Yeah, me neither. That is so cool. It's awesome. Every fish that's not a bass just kind of scares me a little bit. Me oh, too. Trey's got one. Trey's tight. Trey's tight. Oh, he jumped. He's a little one. <laughs> yep, there's my hand with the hook. Jack. Yeah, they are some little slimy grass 
<laughs> Let's go catch your bigger brother. Dude, you already got him on hook. That was mad impressive. You guys, my first ever Jack came on an island survival challenge. Oh, you got one on the boat? Holy smokes, Dre. Oh, that's a good one, too. <laughs> what in the world is going on? We're just slinging fish in left and right. I did not expect this to happen. Every survival challenge we've filmed to this date, we have not caught anything. And they are biting every single cast. I'm letting mine go. I just cut that every time. Dude, I'm a good guy. Oh, I see it's on the front one. Oh. It's, um, it's like three hours later. Our boat ran out of gas. That's my wife with her tongue out. It's also five o'clock. <laughs> yeah, we were out for a while and cameras were dead. We made it back and we're about to sleep probably for like two hours. So here we are. <laughs> this is the most sad survival video. Oh, yes. I'm kind of excited for this. If you guys were there for the last couple oh, hours, oh, you good? Yeah, I just grabbed that shell. <laughs> I didn't know what it was. <laughs> Felt alive. Get underneath the covers, bro. I'm cold and wet. I'm about to get butt naked if you don't. <laughs> oh, so just, there's so many just so many pieces of dirt. It's just sand. Well, we made it. What the fuck is this? <laughs> This is a mattress pad. <laughs> it's another mattress pad. Frick me. I eat this so much. You want some pillow dogs? Sure. That's all I can spare. Well. Early in the morning, late at night. I will wait for you. Good morning. I don't even have the energy to sing. I don't even remember the lyrics. I don't know. Heard that song before? Yeah. No. I will wait. Future and Drake. Oh snap! You heard that thing? Probably so. I'll play it. Oh, <laughs> well, guys, it is a. Uh, what is it? It's. What did you even say it was? Was it four? It's supposed to be five. Oh no! Five o'clock. Five o'clock. So the sun's about to be up at approximately an hour and thirty minutes. Oh, I think we're gonna go to bed. Got anything to say? No. <laughs> Me neither. That's probably the most dead I've ever been on my channel before. And everybody, I apologize, but it has been quite the day. Hey, no, it's granddad. Been a while. Dude, when I closed my eyes, I don't know if it's because of the lights in my eyes, but I saw a Pikachu with a pink birthday hat. I see your granddad wearing a happy birthday hat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, guys, on that note, we're gonna uh, we're gonna go to sleep. That's it. <laughs> we're going to bed. We're going to bed. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Imagine wake up uh, scene. We're just just snuggling. <laughs> well, good morning, guys. Um, last night was like it was all right. It wasn't too bad. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't. Oh man, you made me a sweaty mess though. I took my hoodie off. What's that even? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we successfully. Stayed on the island for about 24 hours <laughs> with the Amazon packages. Oh, frick. There goes the A-frame. Well, it was made in five minutes. We can make another. Guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Wow, I um need I need an energy drink or coffee or something. Thank you guys. We love you. Subscribe to AO. Subscribe to Norm. Subscribe to me. We'll both be linked down below. And drop some new survival ideas down below. If we get 20,000 likes on this video. We'll try to build a boat on a Home Depot pallet. Ooh. Um, there wasn't too much to use in this one, but maybe the next one. Who, Who knows? knows? Dang, that's cool. Yeah, it was. All right. See you guys. You want to kiss them at the same time? Yep. <laughs> Don't kiss me. <laughs> <laughs>
Is that a pallet of lost Amazon goods? <laughs> can you see him? <laughs> I can see him. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Dude, I have my back off. Come on, Hale, come on. <laughs> what kind of slap was that? <laughs>